My name's Carter Phillips, and I'm the chair of the executive committee of Sidley Austin. I don't think any of us would say we've, we've put 2008, 2009 behind us and, and, we're, and we're back to the glory days that, uh, as things existed before then. Revenues were up uh, almost 10 percent. Profits were up by 7 or 8 percent. So in, you know, in those kind of classic metrics, we did well. Uh, it was interesting because it wasn't limited to any single office or any particular practice group being particularly successful. We, we were just stronger across the board, not confident that the market itself is significantly expanding, at least not in the United States. I think it may be expanding somewhat outside in Asia and other places. Uh, obviously, we're going to focus on Singapore. I, I think that'll be an across-the-board type of practice. There'll be an M&A component to it, finance, capital markets. I think in general, Asia remains a place where there are real opportunities to continue to expand and, and we'll do that. Then the U.S., we have some smaller offices that are relatively new in Houston. It's an energy focused practice. That'll be an important part of what we try to expand in 2015. Boston uh, is a very small office at this point. I, ex I expect we'll continue to, to expand that. Palo, Al Palo Alto is also relatively small. So those will be the places where I think our focus in 2015 will be. We were bond counsel of the government of China for decades. And we've been their litigation counsel in a number of contexts. So I, I, our pitch is probably more aimed toward both the government of China and the state-sponsored uh, enterprises that operate, obviously, in China, but do so much more uh, in the United States and throughout the world globally. At this stage, we don't have any aspirations to practice local Chinese law. I, don't, I can't envision how local law could remotely pay the kinds of rates that firms like ours typically charge. It'll be interesting. I'm, I mean, everybody's going to watch the Denton's uh, experience and see how it plays out. Uh, but I, but I, I don't, I'd be shocked to see a lot of firms follow that uh, pattern.